Hi friends, today we will discuss generating modules using Anglo CLI. Use this command to generate module ng generate module and then module name or else we can use the shortcut g for generate m for module and then module name see here this command generates the customer module inside the customer folder and it doesn't register this new module with the app module we can do this in two methods first one is manually we can uh, we can do this let's see open the module file let's include the required import statements here and then make this part of this import array this is the way to register our new model with the app model second method we can instruct the anglo cli to do so at, uh, at the time of generation for this use this command ng gm and then module name and then use this option m dash m or dash module here i am using shortcut dash m and here we have to specify the module name app dot module then here also we can use the dry run flag it simply reports the files and folders are going to be created but not actually creating them let's press the enter key see here this command generate uh, generates employee module um, inside the employee folder and it also registers with update uh, app module see here uh, it doesn't create the spec file if you want the spec file set to dash dash spec equal to true equals true see here the spec file will be created module created and uh, it also updated with app module um, see one more thing um, here employee module is placed inside the employee folder if you don't want the dedicated folder for this new module set uh, dash dash flat equals true okay dash dash flat equals true See here, the um, uh, spec file will be created. The employee module is placed uh, inside the app folder. Okay. If you are satisfied with this above command, let's remove the dry run flag. See here, the new employee module is created. It's placed inside the app folder and it also registered with app module see here the required import statements um, included here and it also made this part of this import sorry okay friends thank you for watching this video in our next video we will learn uh, data binding in anglo cli for more videos like share and subscribe this channel thank you for listening